In this video, we're going to show off Container Modification World's new door seal saving kick plate. A lot of shipping containers get damaged by the user who are opening the doors because they use their foot as leverage against a door seal. That door seal, the it peels away from the door, water gets in there, and it causes premature rusting at the bottom of your door. Uh, another thing, we have just tried to fix the planet and make sure that everyone were educated on how to properly close doors, but it just does not work. We can't train everyone, so instead of training people, we came up with the product to sell you. Follow along. I'm Channing McCorriston, the container guy. So here we have a shipping container. This is one of our rental shipping containers. And you can see here, I don't think this actually was a foot, but some people, when they go to close this, they use their foot as leverage and they, they, uh, they break the door seal. And so our rental units come back and uh, a lot of times the door seal is peeled right out. This could have been a fork or something, but if this instance was typically on the right door, this is where this happens. If we would have had this door seal protector there, it would have fixed it. In fact, that might almost seal her up right there, but we're gonna install this in the right place on the right door and uh, show you how it works. The number one area where you will find rust on a shipping container is at the bottom of the container doors. It is super common where the door meets the door seal to water for water to get inside there and rust out the bottom of your door. And so a lot of that could happen just from wear and tear, the door is not being level and opening the door seal and it grabbing the door. But oftentimes it's actually the user or the owner of the container that's causing the problem. So this thing's a handy tool or if you just need additional leverage to, to close your doors, it's something you can buy. And so this container here, it's got the single handle. Uh, so it gives you lots of extra leverage as it is. But you'd wanna find, if you're gonna install this thing, a comfy, cozy place to put it. And so if you stand up and do a dry run and kind of see where you'd want to push, maybe we can say right there. And it's pretty quick. Uh, a couple easy steps of just grabbing your marker, holding it up. There's a bent profile on this, which is meant to clear the door seal, how it sticks out. And so you can just kind of hold it where you feel you'd want it. Mark your holes. Should probably level it. Drill them out. So they're uh, 3 8 We have some stainless steel carriage bolts here. Got a center punch. You'll want to use a pilot bit and your 3 8 bit and have a wrench on the inside and it'll be pretty much as easy as that. So find the center as best you can. Grab your drill, smaller pilot bit. And step up here, three eighths or slightly larger. I just got a three eighths here, so hopefully she works. That there, three holes drilled out, and then you want to crack your door so you can reach from the inside, but get your, uh, your carriage bolts all lined up. And so the carriage bolts, with the square profile, it is your wrench on this side of the bolt. So once you jump inside, so there you go inside of a couple minutes, we got ourselves a nifty foot pedal there to get inside these containers and give yourself some extra leverage. But this product is something that potentially your everyday user might not be too excited about, but 
for us having a rental fleet and knowing how damaged our containers and our door seals are and how much we have to fix them, it's almost something that all of our competitors are going to enjoy. And, uh, you know, I wish we could almost order direct right from the factories in China with this installed. And so seriously, this is, I kid you not, the first one I've ever installed. Uh, I was hoping I wasn't going to run into any problems on this side and I didn't. So let's close these doors and try it out. So that right there is a quick and easy modification to the doors of a shipping container to make them more user friendly and to protect your rental assets. So if you enjoyed this video and want to see more of us modifying containers and installing accessories, please subscribe to our channel and ring the bell for notifications. Give the video a like to help us out. And as always, check us out at tcg.ca. Hope you learned something.